we're going to look at another color tool in 2009.1 this time we're going to have a look at levels I'm going to double click on the levels tool and also show you how to get there using the panel I'm going to press the color button a second time and click on the level button on the panel you'll notice we have inputs for low mid and high in the base and then on the master we have low and high outputs we also have the same mappings for red green and blue so I'm going to do this on the GUI so in the tool you'll notice the RGB and red green and blue channels separately we have our input levels we have three eyedroppers for shadows midtones and highlights we have the histogram reset tool uh, output levels and auto levels so first thing to look at it would be uh, auto levels hitting auto will automatically set the white and black point and midpoint for this image I'm going to reset that and tell it to keep the current midpoint where it is it will now set the white and black point but keep the current midpoint and resetting that I'm going to tell it to also stretch the red green and blue channel separately and set that automatically so stretching the RGB separately will yield different results and might be handy if there are particular color problems with shots that you want to auto balance something to bear in mind though is that resetting at this point will require you to either reset the entire tool or reset the red green and blue tools separately since the stretch function would work with them individually using my eyedroppers I can choose black mid and highlight areas I then have the option to go and pull those back or push them up on the output or manually move them around on the histogram down here also I can go to any one of my channels and affect the output 